Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, right triangle uh, ABC, as you can see in this given diagram, such that uh, it's uh, one of the legs uh, AB is uh, 1,978 units, whereas uh, this uh, leg BC is uh, 2,022 units. And the high party news uh, AC is being represented by X. And now our task is uh, to find the value of uh, x. In other words, we are going to find the value of this uh, hypotenuse uh, AC. And we are not supposed to be using calculators of any kind. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And in this video, I'm going to share with you with two different approaches. So therefore, please watch the video till the very end. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, right uh, triangle uh, ABC. And we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, A square plus B square equals to C square. And in our case, our two legs are uh, 2022 and 1978, whereas our hypotenuse is uh, X. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So our uh, one of the leg is uh, 20, 22 square, plus uh, the other leg is uh, 1978 uh, square is going to be equal to x uh, square. And now let's focus on the left hand side of this uh, equation. And here I have copied down this uh, left hand side of that uh, equation and we are going to add these uh, numbers without uh, using the calculator and here's our very first method uh, to manipulate uh, this uh, expression and uh, we are going to tweak this uh, 2022 20, this could be written as uh, 2000 plus uh, 22 and this is going to become whole square plus likewise this uh, 1978 could be written as uh, 2 thousand and take away 22 whole square and now if we label uh, 2000 uh, as uh, a I'm going to set uh, a value is 2000 and our b value I'm going to set it equal to 22 in other words this is going to be a this is b likewise this is a and uh, this is uh, b then we can write this one as uh, a plus b whole square and then plus uh, a minus uh, b whole square as well. And now let's recall this uh, famous uh, identity a plus b whole square could be written as a square plus uh, b square plus two times ab. I'm going to apply this one uh, over here on this uh, binomial. And likewise, uh, let's recall another identity a minus b whole square could be written as uh, a square plus b square minus uh, 2 times a b and we are going to apply it uh, on this uh, other uh, binomial. So therefore we can write uh, a square plus uh, b square plus 2 times uh, a b plus likewise uh, a square plus uh, b square minus uh, 2 times a b. And now we can see this uh, 2 a b and minus 2 a b they are gone and we are going to combine uh, these uh, like terms. So therefore we can write this one as uh, 2 times uh, a square plus uh, b square. And now we know our uh, a value is 2000. So I'm going to substitute that value over here. Likewise our b value is uh, 22. I'm going to replace that one with 22. So therefore we can write uh, 2 times uh, this uh, 2000 uh, whole square plus uh, 22 square. And now we know that uh, 2000 whole square uh, means 2 times 2 is going to give us 4. And then we got these uh, 3 zeros. So we're going to put down uh, twice of that much. So 3, 4, 5, 6 zeros. And likewise, uh, 22 square is same as uh, 484. Let's go ahead and distribute uh, 2. So 2 times 4 million is going to give us uh, 8 million. That means 6 uh, zeros plus uh, 
484 times 2 is going to give us 968. So therefore, if we add everything, that is going to give us 800. And then I'm going to write down 968. So thus we can see that our this left hand side, we have simplified it to this number by using this very first method. So therefore, our left hand side turns out to be 8 with 3 zeros and 9 68 turns out to be equal to x square. And now I'm going to undo this square by taking the square root on both sides. So therefore, our x value simply turns out to be the square root of 8 million nine hundred and sixty eight units. So thus our x value turns out to be the square root of 8,968 units by using the very first method. And now let me show you the second method as well. Let's focus once again on the left hand side of this equation. And here I have copied down this expression as you can see. And now let's recall this famous identity once again. A plus B whole square could be written as A square plus B square plus 2 times AB. And now I'm going to move this uh, to a b on the other side to isolate uh, a square plus b square. So therefore we can write uh, a square plus uh, b square is going to be equal to a plus b whole square and minus uh, 2 times uh, a b. So therefore we can transform uh, this uh, identity into another identity as well. So therefore, we are going to apply this uh, identity on this uh, given uh, expression. So therefore, I can assume that uh, 2022 is our lowercase a and uh, 1978 is our lowercase b. Then this could be written as uh, 2022 plus uh, 1978 whole square minus uh, we are going to put down uh, 2 times uh, our a value is uh, 20, 22 and then uh, b value is 1978 and now we can see that 2022 20, plus 1978 is same as 4000 and now we are going to tweak this 2022 uh, 20, could be written as uh, 2000 uh, plus uh, 22 and this uh, 1978 could be written as uh, 2000 uh, minus uh, 22. So therefore we are ended up with uh, 4000 uh, uh, square minus uh, 2 outside uh, and we can write uh, this one as uh, 2000 uh, plus uh, 22 and then this one could be written as uh, 2000 minus 22 and now let's recall another identity a plus b times a minus b is going to be equal to a square minus b square and we are going to apply that identity inside this given bracket and here we can see this part is our a this part is our b likewise a and b so therefore, uh, this could be written as uh, 2000 square minus uh, 22 square. And now we can see 2000 square is going to be 4 with the 6 zero. That means uh, 4 million. And uh, 22 square is going to be 484. And likewise, uh, 4000 whole square is same as 16 with the six zeros. In other words, it's going to be 16 million. As you can see in this uh, next step, now in this uh, next step, I'm going to distribute uh, this uh, negative two. As you can see in this uh, next step, now let's make an observation. We got 16 million minus uh, 8 million is going to give us simply 8 million. That means eight with the six uh, zeros. And if we add them, that is going to give us uh, 
eight million nine hundred and sixty eight. So therefore, we can see our this uh, left hand side uh, has been simplified to this uh, number. So therefore, we can write down uh, eight million nine hundred sixty eight equals to x square. And now I'm going to undo this square by taking a square root on uh, both uh, sides. So therefore, our x value is going to be equal to the square root of uh, eight uh, million nine hundred and sixty-eight uh, units. So thus, our x value turns out to be the square root of eight million nine hundred and sixty-eight uh, units by using the both methods. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.